Right here I have this acrylic display case. I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and show you everything it comes with. This is everything that came inside the box besides the user manual. Right here we have all of the different pieces to assemble the display case. This also does come with a rubber hammer, a light string, double-sided tape. This is a little power supply cord. All you need is a USB unit that plugs into the wall. We have a cleaning cloth as well as some gloves. I do want to mention that all of these acrylic plates here, they do have a protective film on both sides. So before assembling this, first thing we're going to do is remove this protective film. So you can see how nice and clear that looks after removing the protective film. Let me finish removing all of this film from all of these different pieces. So we're going to start by assembling all of these different panels. We're going to do the side and the back panels. They're going to be all the ones with these little protruding pieces on them. You can kind of see them right here by my hand. Now that we have all these side panels in, we're going to go ahead and lay this top panel in place. And then we're just going to use this rubber hammer and lightly tap this into place. Now that the main part of this case is assembled, I'm going to go ahead and assemble this little ladder to place in here. So you can see once we fully assembled all the different pieces here, this little door just slides on and off of the front of the case. That way you can easily access the collectibles that are gonna be inside. I did go ahead and just plug in this little piece back here that turns on the light inside the display case. It does have a little button on it, so you can easily turn it on and off. You can kind of see that display light on the top up here. I just feel like it really nicely illuminates everything inside your case. This double stick tape is gonna be very useful if you do have collectibles that you want to be standing up in a certain way. This would be perfect for that. It does come also with these little string lights, which would be so perfect to just kind of put in around your little display items in here. And you can easily just push the little button on here and select the setting that you want and have this all set up and ready to go. I'm gonna go ahead and put the display items in here that we were gonna use this for so I can show you what that looked like. Okay, you can see we have this case fully assembled and we filled it with all of the kids' little collectible toys here. I actually added the little twinkle lights in there, which looks so cool. I just wanted to turn the lights down low so you can see how much light actually goes to this display case. This is the five tier one. So this is 12.6 inches by 12.2 inches by 11.8 inches. So it's really close to one foot by one foot in all directions. You can see that the actual figure holder here has four different levels and then you have this base level in the front. I love that you can easily remove everything just by pulling aside this little front part of the display case. And it just looks so sleek and nice and clean the way that this is actually set up. I love that it has everything that you need to build this from start to finish. You don't need any extra tools and it's really easy to turn off the light. You can see we just have the little twinkle lights on the inside, which is really cute as well. I do feel like this light does light up this entire display case, which is so cool. I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the light so you can see what that looks like as well. You can see it just really helps to accentuate all of the cool features of the different figures or collectibles that you decide to put in here. I do like that you can actually combine some of the different display cases as well by stacking them on top of each other or putting them next to each other, for example. And it is nice that it comes with this little cleaning rag in order to clean off little smudges as well as the gloves in order to use them while you're opening and closing this display case and placing your figures inside. I did want to mention that the instructions are all in these really nice, easy to understand pictures so you didn't have any questions when assembling this. Overall, I'm really impressed with how this looks and the kids are absolutely going to love this way of displaying some of their neat items.